Hi, welcome to the Commercial Gas Engineer channel. Just working on this Valent Ecotech A24 Plus. I came here because they had no central heating. Ignore the foot code on it at the moment. What was happening was they had no heating, but the boiler was igniting and there was a hot water symbol on. And also when you press the I button for sequence, it was saying um, that hot water was required and well, hot water was being used and no outlets were being used so I did some investigating and then this is what I found so after digging up the tiles and the floor found a leak on the cold water supply in the concrete screed and just above it there was a T here like this also going in the concrete screed and then there was a leak also on the hot water supply so this is why the hot water was constantly demanding the boiler to come on but at the same time there was a slow leak on the cold water supply um, the client has had rising damp for probably a decade or more and um, I dug up the tiles and the floor and I found this here so I'm gonna repair the pipework so that they can have hot water and so on I'm not sure if you've had this problem before where there's been um, a leak in the concrete screed they did cover it with some plastic and so on but uh, the pipes the tension on the pipes this pipe was pressing down on this pipe there was no crossovers no passovers it was just forced on like this I don't see why it couldn't have been the pipes couldn't have been run behind the kitchen unit just as the gas pipe was run by the kitchen unit and by the way when you do this make sure that pipes are clipped properly some are clipped here but this gas pipe wants to be clipped at some point hopefully it's clipped through there I'll be checking that later but just try not to practice pipe work like this where it's squashed together and if you if you do put it in concrete um, sometimes try and make a towel accessible or or just make sure the pipe's protected sleeve it probably put um, pay for 28 mil pipe to sleeve to protect it like you for instance you've got gas pipe here this one in the center and it's not been protected well enough for a gas pipe I've done a tightness test on it and there's no leak but it's just a matter of time before this gas pipe gives way so I'm going to put some Denzel tape on it, but ideally it should be sleeved with like 22 mil pipe coming through this concrete. All right, leave your comments in the section below. Um, and also ways that you go about looking for leaks under the floor. Sometimes you can use a camera, a um, thermal camera to see where the spread is on the camera. You would see the lines of the heated pipe and then a spread of heat. Or you can use a moisture meters that you can put and it will show where the moisture is in the ground uh, where it's greatest or you can do little pilot holes pilot holes to see if there's water coming up as you do the holes more water and so on but it's not easy to find a leak i started from all the way at the other end about four tiles away and worked my way and there was water there but the water's been running down downhill water finds the line of least resistance as you may know so all right just bear that in mind guys um, when looking for leaks or hopefully not creating leaks by doing pipe work in screeded floor like this all right until next time bye bye bye